How you going, fellas? Here we go. We got the tenants lager, the 1885 lager. Whatever that means. Anyway, I don't think I've had this one before. I'll give it a crack. Crack in the double, the double glass glass. How's that one? A trip here, though. It's got the inside and an outside glass. Cheers. Tenants Extra. No, it's not. It's not Tenants Super. No. We've got Tenants Lager. Actually, it's a really nice lager. It tastes really clean. Well filtered. Got plenty of flavour. It's got that real lager flavour. If you like it, I actually like a good lager. I've had a few lagers I've really enjoyed, like fantastic. This one's probably one of the better lagers I've had. Mmm. Full kick ass lager. I had a beauty in Hawaii, I remember. But it was a strong one too. It was about 5.8 or 6%. Jeez, that was nice. When are they all do it? This is 5%. You know, and I think a lot of lagers are a bit less than that. So what do they reckon, the Scottish beer maestros? Here we go. The, no the Noble Pilsner with fruity and hoppy touches. Well, they're right on the ball again. It's got backbone, it's got flavour for a lager. Don't usually get all that. So we're happy days with that one. Cheers, fellas. Get on to that. If you see it, jump on it. Cheers.